Passengers on a bus trip to the Big Apple say they were afraid for their lives, but the driver tells another story. The controversy, our top story here on Newswatch 16 at 6. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Stacy Lang. We begin tonight in Scranton, where passengers on a bus trip from Scranton to New York City say a day to the city was overshadowed by the scary ride there. Newswatch 16's Cassie Semyon spoke with both passengers and the driver. She's live now at the Lackawanna Transit Center with more. Cassie. Stacy, that passenger says she has taken the bus multiple times to New York City from Scranton and never had a problem before, but this ride had her and other passengers fearing for their lives. It was supposed to be a nice day in New York City for a busload of passengers out of Scranton, but passenger Rosemarie Crotty says it was anything but. People were on their phones constantly texting family members, letting people know what was happening, that we felt like we were in timeout, that we felt like we were being held hostage. Crotty says the March bus trip began with the driver playing the safety recording, but says she got angry when people were talking. So she then started off by saying everyone needs to be quiet. It's the rules. You cannot talk. And we all looked at each other, you know, like we can't whisper. No, you cannot talk at all. Crotty says during the ride, the driver stopped multiple times to reprimand them for talking, even at unplanned stops. She came from her seat carrying a piece of paper and pencil, and she said, I want everybody's names. She said, people are talking, and I want to kick you off this bus. Well, then everybody came, became alarmed. And she said, I am not moving this bus until someone gets off and you stop talking. Another passenger sent Newswatch 16 this screenshot from the Waze app, showing that the bus was going 74 miles per hour in a 55 zone. The passenger said the driver was driving erratically. Upon arriving at Port Authority in New York, Crotty says passengers confronted the driver and wanted to know her name. That's when they posted this video to Facebook. We reached out to Mart's Trailways multiple times for comment on the incident and have yet to hear back. But earlier we saw a woman driving a Mart's bus who appeared to be that same driver. We spoke to that Mart's driver by phone who confirmed she was driving today. She says what the passengers described is not what happened. She told Newswatch 16, quote, I had a bunch of disrespectful adults on the bus. They were very loud. They didn't want to follow the rules of Mart's. The driver claims the passengers were cursing at her, and she gave the middle finger to their cameras out of frustration. Crotty has traveled to New York by bus many times before and said she has never had an experience like this and has never been told not to talk on the bus. People were casually talking. Nobody was loud. I mean, it was a leisure bus. It wasn't a bus trip of small children. It was a leisure bus. We were all adults. And those passengers were driven home from New York by a different driver, and they say that they have been in touch with Martz about the situation. Cassie Simeon, Newswatch 16, live in Scranton. Cassie, thank you.